Good morning, it is Friday of Comic Con. I am dressed and ready. I'm going as Merlin today, who is an absolute bean and one of my favourite shows, and I'm so happy with this costume. You might have seen that I made a jacket tutorial for it. I did not do the rest because I got too excited and forgot to record me making the shirt and the trousers. You didn't see that, but I stuck my leg out because, like, stick your leggy out. And, uh,. Did get priority entry for like the entire weekend, but I have to go to school to do a debate first. Luckily, Halloween fancy dress day. So I'm able to just go in like this and then I'm going to do a debate, which is on AI, which I am very fond of due to good old Detroit become human because Connor is a bean, literally, physically, mentally, I love him. And then after the debate, I will be going to con I will update you on how the, like, the debate goes because you know what that's like vital information from me I'll be leaving in like three minutes to go to school and then yeah that will be fun I'll update you in a bit hopefully if I remember I better remember because I've got like this entire plan to vlog for this weekend and if I don't then it's gonna be a bit disappointing won't it also you're getting a lovely tour of my kitchen like there's my plants there's my fridge there's a cupboard what more can you want in life? So, toodaloo. So we are now at the train station waiting to get our train, which is in approximately six minutes. I won the debate, which was very exciting. Oh dear Lord. Um, this is my mother. My mother is a bear. <laughs> I'm scared. Um, I try to get things from a vending machine, but the vending machine is being really rude and not letting me have anything. And so I'm gonna be hungry for a bit. Uh, yeah, I don't know anything else that's going to be that exciting. Oh no, right, <laughs> no, you can leave. <laughs> yeah, so hopefully when we get there, it won't be too busy because I am excited. Also, I got recognised at school. Somebody literally like yells at me, oh, cosplay at me at school. And you know when that's just like an achievement being called out for what I do and it's just great. So I'll update you when we're on the train, hopefully, maybe, I don't really know. Also, Colin Morgan is Bay. Bye! We've been on the train for a little while now, which is quite nice. We've still got quite far to go until we get to the XL Centre. Oh, and that Cupid Spoke contour is strong. Um, oh, you want to come back here, do you? <laughs> so our plan for when we get in the sort of corner centre is A, food. Do you, want to, do you want to go hide now? Okay, <laughs> <laughs> Our plan is to get food and then go around the dealer's hall until three because then they've got a greater showman sing along. And you know what? I'm not a big fan of what they did with it, but I enjoy the music. So I want to go to that and also see the cosplay championships because that is something I can aspire to in my life because I'm sad. But you know what? We're all we're all at this con to bond over our love of characters, our love of costume making, and I'm on this train and there are people here and they weren't here before and you know when it's just a bit awkward, oh my eye colour is lovely, oh my ass. Um <laughs> leave me alone, I can appreciate my own eye colour, okay? Um, yeah, there's not much else to add. Uh, my mum did bring marmalade in her suit, right, do you want us? She's very, she's very <laughs> proud of her marmalade. She's very proud of her briefcase. She's very proud of this. She's a big Paddington fan. She ain't much of a cosplayer, but look at her go, cosplaying as Paddington Bear. Um, I'll update you either when we're close or at the con centre in a line, maybe. Where are we now? I've got no clue, love. We're at a station. New Southgate. We're at New Southgate. If you're wondering, top quality entertainment coming at you. Yas. So we're now on the DHLR going to the con. Uh, we'll be there soon, hopefully. If not, then we'll just survive. I'm really hungry. I haven't eaten since yeah. six and I'm looking forward to the actual I can't see a thing. She can't. <laughs> she's doing great as Paddington there. Oh, no. Right, she's weird. Go, leave. <laughs> no, no. Uh, yeah. 
So hopefully we'll be there soon. I'm looking forward to food. Food is the main priority. I need food in my life. Help me. I need food. This is my lips. Do you want food? Yes, we do want no. food. <laughs> you don't. You don't. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, hopefully I'll see people. I don't know. Right, you'll be really creepy. <laughs> Uh, right, bye bye. <laughs> I go now because she's being weird, and you know what? I love her dearly, but <laughs> she's a bit. She's special. Right, right. We made it. We're at the Excel Centre, waiting for my mum to have her cigarette. But you know what? Nicotine is more important than getting into a con. But you know what? I can I can deal with that. She got my train ticket. She paid for me to travel here, which is rather nice. <laughs> da, 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 da. Look at her being oblivious. Yeah, I'm looking forward to food. Food is the main priority at the moment because I am hungry as hell. I'm so hungry. Like, you don't understand my pain. I keep on going like this because you know what? My eyes emphasize my pain. Yeah. Um, there's not much else. Yeah, it's a bit cold. There is a Velma cosplay on the train and there is also some kids. It's just like, oh my god, come the Comic Con is like nine years away. And I was just like, I feel your pain, kid. I feel your pain. Like I'm hyped as you. But yeah. Training, we had a bit of an issue. We got on the wrong train at like one point. You know what? We made it. We're here. We're alive. We're doing well. We are doing the thing. We are the thing. We are. We are one. Yeah, yeah, all one's out. Beautiful. Bye. So, I don't know if you can hear me, but we've been at Con for about an hour and a half now. I have already spent too much money buying merch. There's so much Connor stuff, and Connor is a bean, and I love him. There's also been so much Chat Noir stuff, and you know what? I love Chat Noir, I love him, I love Ladybug, and it's just like top quality. Um, we're currently outside because once again, Metherin needed a cigarette break. Uh, I saw uh, Icy Hot Cosplay, who will be linked down below. Uh, he's an absolute star and he waved to me and I'm glad I realised it was him because you know what, he's such a nice guy. 10 out of 10, would recommend you go like check out his socials and stuff. He also has a channel, I believe, I believe it's Icy Hot Cosplay. I'm not entirely sure, but he has like a My Hero Academia a CMB up there. Oh. And the cosplays have been really nice as well. Like there's been so many good ones. There's this, like little little kid dressed up as group, which was adorable. There's a lot of My Hero Academia, which you know is a surprise. I've seen a couple of ladybugs. I've seen a Chat Noir. Uh, there's a beautiful bell over there, however I feel bad like showing because you know. Also there was a hawk moth, and you know when it's just like you don't really see hawk moths, so I was just like but like we was in like the dealer's area so it's like a bit too busy in order to go see that. Uh, but yeah I'm having a pretty decent time. I always find it with cons that like my left shoulder always aches and it's just a bit like I don't know why. It might be because I just rest my bag on it. But it shouldn't be hurting because my bag is really light. Oh I also got a potato shirts like uh, adventures of the potato and you know what it's just like that was 10 pounds but it's a worth of purchase because you know what potatoes are amazing i love potatoes it's just it's just such a weird vegetable uh, yeah so we're gonna go watch masquerade at five and then probably head back we've still got the other steelers room to do um which will be a mistake because you know that was the bell she's uh, yeah, well, see you all in a bit. So we are currently in the main stage waiting for the cosplay masquerade to go on because, you know, that is what we like to do. My mum is eating Cheetos. Um, I have got some great, great things. I went to the tea store, which if you haven't been to, I got a Cassiel tea strain from there, like, last year. And this time, I got some Hufflepuff tea and you know how hard it is to find Hufflepuff merch? Fellow Hufflepuffs will know. And you know what? Hufflepuffs deserve some love. And it's quite lucky because it sounds quite pleasant. It's got black tea, butterscotch pieces, Canadea petals and sunflower petals. And like I'm really excited to try this with my Castiel tea chain from a year ago, which I haven't been able to use because I've never had loose tea. And also like they also had prints there and the Loki tea didn't seem that nice because like, I'm finicky, but they did have 
a low key print, and you know when it's just like my boy, my beautiful, my beautiful boy, yes. I'm a big fan of Loki. Loki is like, yeah. Even in like the actual like Norse myths, I'm a big fan of him. Like his stories, like other ones that get me. It's just like, oh yes, I need to think of a way that they won't catch me by snake and net. How would they catch me? And it's just like quite entertaining. Also, it was some girl's birthday, so she got up on stage and got a pickle rake, which is quite exciting. True choice. Um, I'll do a tour of everything I've got today. Uh, later on, I also need to finish my cosplay for the masquerade tomorrow, which is a secret cosplay, so you can look forward to that. Um, my mum won't be joining me tomorrow, but I will have, um, I wouldn't call a friend, because I'm not, I'm stubborn, I refuse to call him my friend, but, um, <laughs> I'm sorry, I said I wouldn't say it, and I hate saying it. He's an acquaintance. He is an acquaintance. And he'll be coming with me on Saturday and Sunday instead of my madre because my madre sadly has work selling drugs. She is a pharmacist, not an actual drug dealer. Please don't sue me. Um, <laughs> yeah, so, oh, hello. Right, ladies and gentlemen, we've got Ooh. some time to give you away some more marshmallow and fingerings. So, thanks for I'm going to disappear because he's giving away fingerings and I love fingerings. Yes. So, walking back home from L con on the first day it is rather cold and rather dark just uh, we went to kfc to get some food it's where i work and i felt bad for making a mess so then i wiped down the table uh, <laughs> uh, yeah however i just feel like an inconvenience and i feel really bad because i know the work that they've got to do when i leave and it's just like mm. um need to go be at the station for half seven tomorrow in order to get to con center which will be fun which means i need to get up around uh, quite early five. But, oh my god it would be as well so i need to be up at five tomorrow my secret cosplay for tomorrow is not done nor is the wig styled so i need to finish off that when i get home it's also really cold, like I understand it's October. Also this costume isn't like, isn't the most like insulating. How the man is left in those woods, I do not know. <laughs> um, oh, I got to recognize this man in a bit and it was really nice because I had been getting like, uh, like Craig or something from Dragon Ball Z. Callum. Callum, Callum, it was Callum. <laughs> And then, like, it was being a bit disheartening and powerful by, like, the end of it. Uh, I got, like, oh my god, I love you, Merlin. And it, was just, it just made me so happy. And then me and this uh, human, we were talking about how, like, the ending. And then there was this Giselle cosplayer from Enchanted in the wedding dress. And then we were having a conversation about the ending as well, which was great. And it was just really enjoyable switching hands because my arm's getting tired. And what else? Uh, the masquerade was really good. Like it was one for like overall championship, so there's only four people there, uh, four people like performing. But their costumes were amazing. Like there was um, white crystal from Steven Universe, a Loki cosplayer, and someone from Overwatch, and someone from World of Warcraft. And their costumes were absolutely amazing. It's just like one of those things where when you go and watch it you're just inspired to make more by it and it's just like oh it was really good and you know like I aspire to be that good of a cosplayer one day but you know if that ever happens then we've made a mistake <laughs> yeah uh, not much, much else happened after that I got on the train I went there uh, uh, I also got complimented by like one of my teammates at work for my outfit and you know when it's just like thank you if I would dress like this every day I probably would but you know what it's not like the most practical thing um, my pocket. yeah it has no pockets and you know when it's just like like even though I'm using my bag which I have for Todoroki which you could see if you follow my Instagram small plug <laughs> small person cosplay uh, yeah uh, I will I'm looking forward to trying the tea. I will film me trying the tea because I'm not much of a tea person. Well, I like English breakfast tea. Drank that ever since I was a little babby. 
Uh, I was an awkward child. I had tea. I didn't have milk. I had tea. I was so British. <laughs> yeah. And then I need to check my emails to get the work which I missed. <sighs> but apart from that, I'll update you in a bit. Uh, once I've started doing cos work, it is also freezing. Like, PSA to people when it's October bring some form of layer because I didn't want to ruin my costume and you know what because like a modern jacket wouldn't fit with Merlin and you know what I'm still gonna carry that pride tomorrow when I'm walking to con well walking to station at seven o'clock in the morning I will not use a coat because you know what it will ruin the look because it's all about that Luke darling <sighs> so see you in a bit when I'm doing work or drinking tea, whichever one comes first, probably tea because I'm a weakling and I can't survive in the cold because I am a small bean! <sighs> See you in a bit guys! <sighs> 